Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. In this video, I'm going to show you five, hold on, hold on, five coins that you can grab under a penny at the time of recording this video. If it sounds interesting to you, please drop that like, give me a subscribe if you're watching and before I dive into this, I need to let you know I am not a financial advisor. You know, you got to put that because, you know, people get funny if it goes down in price. Please do your further research before you invest your money. Coin number one. <coughs> Clear my throat for this. That you can grab under a penny right now is... What am I laughing for? Uh, Binamon. Let me talk to you about Binamon. Binamon is a play to earn. And I'll tell you what. <coughs> it's been doing really well over the last few months of you know progressing in its project and you can see on their twitter that they're in like the top 10 for most of these like uh insights are they, are they called insights different charts gaming charts whatever you want to call them they've been hitting top 10 all the time it says here look top 10 nft gaming by lunar crush galaxy score so you know that's a good look because if you're if you're constantly in uh, what's this Squid Game? I'm gonna have to look into that in a second. Edge, let's have a look. Uh, are you Emon's ready for Squid Game series? So they're looking to do a Squid Game series. Uh, green light, red light on Monday. So I'm guessing that's coming this Monday because you know 20, 20, the twenty first of February. So check that one out. But they've been progressing all the time. They've been keep, you know, they've kept doing what they said they're going to do in there, according to what I believe, uh, their roadmap. And they're getting top 10 charts all the time. Well, top 10 in these different charts. Look, top 10 GameFi uh, with best social signal in the last seven days. So, you know, that's a good look for the project. You can grab it under a penny right now. It's sitting at 005. So for those that are new... I think that this could really par up to <coughs> Axie Infinity and things like that. This is a very ambitious project, and I'm right at the bottom. Let me scroll up, because, you know, I'm sc scrolling through and whatnot. <coughs> Binamon is very ambitious. So you can play to earn. You can... Can you breed on this yet? I don't know. I'm going to have to check. But I know you can do PvP, which is player versus player. PvE, player versus... Enemy? I'm guessing. They've got a Binder Dex here, which I'm guessing you can see which type of Binamon you have. And they have a marketplace. Let's visit the marketplace, see how much their NFT characters are going for. So if we scroll down, does it show? You've got a few here, which is the latest trade. Someone's trading these 0 0.03 BNB, 0 0.01. So, you know, what is that? I can't work it out. They're cheap. They're not overly expensive. You know, you can afford to get these um, uh, NFTs or characters that you can battle with. So, maybe you should check it out if you're into, you know, playing these uh, play-to-earn games. Let me just quick home again because I want to show you... Have I got it up still? Here. I want to show you what things really interested me about this project. I can't remember what, what players they had back then, but it says here 243,000 players are playing. That's a good look. What interested me the most, I'm looking at, just looking at everything, ROI, return on investment, uh, was that you could buy land. And I don't know if they've updated it yet. Maybe it's still coming in Q2 of this year. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, but they, they were saying that we were able to buy land. I'm coming down low. Here we go. Conquering buy the land. So, you know, buy, sell, and bid for land. This is what got me super hyped for it. And on top of that, look, Guild War for lands, build your own castle. And here, look, you know, you can decorate your house, build your house, and all this stuff. This is like, I suppose you need to have some, some form of a metaverse in order to do this. I don't know. Tell me, drop some comments down below if, if they're already doing it or if you know how they're going to do it. But all this stuff is what got me hyped for the project. So, you know, it's still ambitious. It's still got good uh, uh, goal to achieve if it can achieve all this. What would it do to the price? Because right now, you know, what, what's the actual market cap of this right now? I know it's tiny. You can grab it under a penny, 005. That's half a penny, darling. Let's go on to PooCoins and have a look at what kind of market cap it's sitting on. <coughs> got to clear my throat. Here we go. Uh, let's search this. Binamon. So right now, Binamon has a $7 million market cap. It is seriously tiny. Because when you compare it to like big projects like the Axie Infinities and stuff that's sitting on billions, you know, should Binamon take a share of these coins, it can absolutely explode in price. I think it's possible for Binamon in the future to in the future to go to maybe half a billion, a billion. Half a billion, you know, that's insane. You know, even 700 million, that's 100x right there. 740 million, because I'm looking at the price, see? Right here. If it did 100 times your money back, which means if you put like 100 pounds in, it turns to 10 grand. 1,000 pounds turns to 100 grand. 100x, 
You know, you're, you're talking $741 million market cap. I think it can achieve that. If it delivers on the land, because people love virtual land. I love virtual land. And that will get me in your project <clears throat> to wanting to buy the land and do more. If you can buy it, someone drop the comments, let me know, because I will consider maybe buying some land. So, you know, it's had a bit of a fall since then, since it, when it came out. This is a good time to be buying, in my eyes. <clears throat> Under a penny, not investment advice. Look into it more before you decide to buy it. Coin number two, if you still like the play to earn stuff that you can grab under a penny is Gamers. Gamers was your interactive social metaverse type of block, uh, blockchain project, blockchain project. And the way I saw it, which I still believe it is, is you can come onto their app. Have they launched it now? Is it live? Is it active? Still coming soon. And you could basically see what everybody's talking about. What's the hottest game? Who's talking about what? What games are going to be big? And that's what it's about. So I guess this right here that's loaded up is like an, a, a, a beta version. A beta? Ver a beta? Pre-alpha? Whatever it is. Uh, it's just talking. It just shows you how the layout would look. Now, if I was to use this as a crypto YouTuber and I was to share what I thought my favorite games were, uh, games were you'd probably see it here before I put it on YouTube because, you know, this is a place where people socialize and interact with each other talk about the hottest games and whatnot so that's why i think that this still has potential i'm still using it or holding it i'm still staking the coin because you can stake it for some passive income by clicking staking at the top and yeah so you know there's a space for something like this when you think about um facebook groups you always you know and i know you do i know you've been in groups before and you go to those specific groups because you want certain things for example, if you want to buy furniture, uh, furniture, if you want to buy a puppy or whatever it is that you want to buy or, or look at, you join the group. And that's pretty much how I see this. I see people coming in to the metaverse or whatever it is. You know, there'd be different categories like metaverse, you know, AR, VR, gaming. And people will be able to select the group they want, look at who's talking about what and try and get involved in the projects way before they even pump or come out. Because I'm assuming that people are going to be talking about hot projects, hot games that haven't even come out yet as well. Because I would be. So that's that. And if you like that, you know, maybe look into gamers because it is sitting under a penny. 006. This had a big fall down. And, you know, can it come back up? Time will tell. According to CoinGecko, it has a 500,000. Not a million. <laughs> it has a 500,000, 560,000 market cap. Which means... You don't need a lot of buy power for this to 100x and make you absolute insane gains. Because, you know, again, if you had a thousand pounds and you times it by 100x, what are we talking? You're talking a hundred thousand pounds and the market cap will only be a 56 million market cap. So that's why it's good to maybe buy at prices like now. Again, it's not investment advice. I'm just showing you coins that you can get under a penny. <laughs> the next coin that you can grab under one pence is. A bit of silence there. <laughs> well, I thought. This one here. Dent. What's the one next to it? Hold on. Uh, what is that? Oh, that's the gamers thing. So Dent is your uh, decentralized mobile data. Simplified. So I guess they're making sims that you can put in your phone. And you can basically pay for mobile data with your crypto. If so, that is big. Because I've not seen any other project do it. And I've been holding Dent for a long time. I remember doing a buy alert. Clearly, it's a lot cheaper now. Because, you know, Dent fell with the rest of the market. What are we talking? Dent is sitting on 001 fragments of a penny. How much would £1,000 give you today? You know, £1,000 would give you half a million of these tokens. So technically speaking, £2,000 could give you over a million tokens. Why am I saying a million? Because a million could be a good goal, guys. Because look at how high this went before. If you invested two grand today, and it's not investment advice, I'm just saying, and it goes just back to all-time highs, which was what? What's this over here? Can't even get to the top. Uh, over here, you can see as well, the highest that this went was seven pence. You would basically be have. You would basically have. Is that right? No. If you had a million of them, that's seventy grand. That that doesn't sound right. Let me just see this. <laughs> really? If you had a million million of these tokens, and it goes to seventy pence. Uh, 7 pence times it by 0 0.07. 70 grand! That's mad! If it goes back to its all-time high, you could be sitting on 70,000 pounds. 
crap. And I think it can achieve it. Time's going to tell. You know, look at the website more in your own time. Do more research. If you want to know more about uh, Dent, I have done many videos on Dent. Or at least I believe I have. Which break it down and talk about it more. Ain't staking coming to Dent? Because, you know, I want to be staking. Look at this Giga store. What's this Dent? Dent gig? I didn't see this before. Join the first uh, uh, reseller. Hold on. The first reseller platform for eSIM mobile data packages. Our flexible integration uh, options and competitive prices make it easy to set up an eSIM sales channel how you want. Really? Open your mobile data reselling possibilities. What do you mean reselling? You're telling me you sell your data and earn? Cool, because if that's the case, cool. You know, you know that that is cool. <laughs> you know, you got data. People want to use data quick. Because you know, sometimes like when you be chilling somewhere and you need to just get on Wi-Fi quick. Because I tell you what, some places I go to has got crap signal. And if I haven't got a Wi-Fi signal, I'm sitting there with that letter H on my phone. It's just terrible. Uh, so you know, if if I looked and I could see loads of diff different like dent Wi-Fi hubs that I can just connect to, you know, and then you're they're getting paid because you're connected to the Wi-Fi hub. I'm just saying, you know, that could really work. Uh, so, you know, this could, you know, I'm still kind of bullish on this. I think it's going to do really well in the future. I'm just holding tight. I've got a nice bag of this and I'm holding tight. But what's going on with the staking? Because I know you guys were talking about staking eventually. Are you staking now? Someone drop some comments, please, if you're into Dent and let me know when you can stake this. Here's the team here. So, you know, fully docs, check them out. Do your further research on it. Uh, again, 0019. So, you know, fragments, what is it, two fifths? Of a penny, I think that's right. Because if it was zero zero two, two four six eight one penny, yeah. So I think that's right. Two fifths. Let me know. Uh, I think it's a good buy, and I think having a million of these tokens could seriously set you up for greatness in the future. Should it go there? What market cap is it right now? One hundred eighty market cap. What would a hundred X look like? I don't know. What do you think? Can it achieve it? I mean, a hundred X would put it on a. 18 billion market cap you just don't know if it took five years fine you know because what would that do to the price times 10 uh, uh penny two pence times 100 you look about 19 pence so you'd be sitting large right you know you'll have like a, a hundred that no what would that be you'd have 190,000 pounds if it went there if you had a million of them just saying a million times 0.19 uh yeah you'll have 190 grand life changing for some so you know can it go there time's going to tell uh 18 billion it might be possible you know you got to remember the uh the sims you know the data the mobile data industry is massive and you know this right now data is important you, if you can't connect your phone to a data you know because when you're out you've got no wi-fi if you can't connect your data you can't get online it's a big issue so you know, this is solving a great problem, being able to pay for, you know, your SIM, your data with cryptocurrency. It's a good look. It's the first one, first project that I've seen that can do that. So big up to them. Uh, the next coin that you can grab under a penny is <coughs> Telcoin. If you was a patron of mine, you did see my buy alerts on Telcoin. I bought some of this. I bought a huge bag of this. And if you want to do so as well, you can. But my patrons see this stuff first. And if you don't want to miss out, guys, become a patron. I've got seven tiers. Take your pick. I say it all the time. I know. Got to let you know. Uh, I recommend my exclusive VIP partner tier because this one unlocks all my posts. You can see when I buy, when I sell, when I stake. All in there. Click on the post and you see it. If you want that little bit more, go for my CEO tier. I'm trying to do it quick. CEO tier gives you my super alerts. You get access to my VIP tip. Oh, <laughs> bit my cheek. <laughs> Not cutting it raw fresh on a guy like Tesco's. Uh, it gives you access to my VIP Telegram group where I talk to everybody way before I do stuff, sharing constant stuff in there. Big uh, crypto users talking about big projects, sharing big, uh, making big money, sharing all sorts. Guys, if you can afford it, go for it. Going back to this, Telcoin, send money smarter. You know, there's billions of people in the world in Africa. Asia, that area which do not have access to a bank and it makes it hard for them to send payments to their friends and family and I think Telcoin is trying to solve this and there's another project as well which we've been buying in my Patreon uh, which is mega cheap, trust me and these patrons with the buy-lets can see it right now and you guys are going to see it a couple of days or however when I decide to upload it on YouTube. But again, if you don't want to miss this stuff, check it out because I tell you what, this other project that's just like Telcoin, 200 quid's worth will get you a million tokens. <laughs> so now's the time to be buying. Become a patron so you don't miss it. Uh, but going back on Telcoin, I think it has potential. And I just recently bought into this. I shuffled some 
you know, money around to buy it. Telcoin leverages blockchain te- uh, technology to prov- provide low cost, high quality financial products for every mobile phone user. Like I said, people in Asia or, you know, India or Africa, they don't have access to banks. They can't get a bank, but they've got a phone. And if you've got a phone and your mum's got a phone and your sister's got a phone and your auntie, yes, auntie, <laughs> you know, it's coming in it. Mummy, what is it? I, I want to send something to mum. Uh, I want to send some money to auntie, mummy. Who go and ask auntie where she wants. Well, mummy, uh, I don't have a number. It is 07825. One, two, eight, six, six, three. I know you're going to be trying to check that as well. It's a fake number. I just made it up. But, you know, even though I've made that number up, <laughs> it's probably someone's number. I can't remember what it was. I have to go back and play it back. Uh, I've lost myself. <laughs> I'm just going to leave it. But, yeah, what I'm saying is <laughs> uh, you can send payments to anyone in your family, friends, Super easy, you know, my mum be looking like... Anyway, uh, I think it's a good buy. And I think buying some now under a penny could seriously set you up for greatness in the future. It's down from the time that I bought. You know, cool, fine, long-term hold kind of thing. What would it look like if it did 100x? You know, what, what would it look like if these, you know, big countries with all these people that are struggling to make payments, started to adopt this and, you know, became the main coin to be sending forward and backwards to your friends and family. Because it can seriously 100x. It could go into the billions, guys. It really can. Don't underestimate it. Times it by 100. What are we talking? 100x will pull out a 32 billion market cap. Will it happen this cycle? Maybe not. Will it happen next one? Maybe. Because, you know, each time that there's a new cycle, more and more people come come into the crypto space. And you wasn't here back in 2017, was you? And if you were, cool, great, hello, big up to you. But a lot of the people that come in now and watching my channel now came in way after this pump of like Bitcoin going to like 60K, you know, back in January. So, uh, you know, if you've been around long, you know how it works. You buy coins cheap and as time goes on, they pump up and they get a chance, you get a chance to sell them on. Uh, So, you know, Telcoin could be one to watch. Uh, my fifth and final coin that you could buy under a penny right now is <laughs> Bit of Drift, Drift, Drive, Drift, Drive, 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 because it looks like Drive, but it's got the F, so it's Drive, D-R-F token, D- D- Drift, Drift. <laughs> whatever it is, Drive, I spoke about this a few days ago on my channel, and I'm going to go to it so I can show you, this right here, DAOs. Please understand what DAOs are and what they're trying to do because DAOs, decentralized autonomous autonomous organizations, it gives everybody a chance to own something bigger. For example, in that video, I talked about everybody owning a football team (laughs) and you all get a chance to vote on how things should go in that team. Same goes for Drive. Drive is like the taxi, it's like the Uber, 3.0 of taxi servicing, ride, hailing, uh, is that right, howling, hailing, reimagined, so think of Uber, but think of owning that car, and you can say to this taxi, how much distance it should go, what it should look like, uh, you know, that's what this is about, and it, and the good thing of drive is, people that are taxi drivers, you get to own more percentage of your money, and uh, it's, would it work out cheaper for the people that are paying as well? Because it's decentralized. It's cutting that middleman out. This could disrupt Uber. If it plays, you know, if it continues to do what it does, it could seriously disrupt Uber. And this could be a big thing. Decentralized taxis, decentralized vehicles, decentralized transport. Taking you from A to B, cutting out the middleman. They make crazy money. We own it. You know, you own the car. Maybe in the future, there's a say on, you know, how the car should look how many miles it should go. I don't know which areas it can go. Maybe there's a say on that because it's a DAO. Have a look right here. I'm scrolling down to show you real quick. Uh, what does it say DAO? Because I, I know I saw it somewhere. Here we go. Governance. The, platfo- the platform ex- itself. Hold on. Get out. The platform itself. Is there another platform or are we talking about cars here? The platform itself is governed by a DAO where everyone can purchase in decision making by putting forth proposals and voting on them. So this, okay, I'm guess maybe not on about the, the app, but what I'm saying is it's great to know that you can be a part, because you imagine owning Uber 
I guess it is the app. Imagine owning Uber and you can decide how things go in Uber, where people can drive, what they have to do. Do they need a driving license in order? Do you have to show proof of this and that? I'm just saying because, you know, they might do a thing in the future where anyone can just drive. You can just get in your car, become a drive, you know, a drive driver because you can drive. You've got a license. Just prove you've got a license. That might become something that the, the everyone that's involved in this project might say, look, fed up with all this needing a taxi license and all this crap. <laughs> I don't know if you can do that or not. <clears throat> Time's going to tell. But maybe they can govern on that and make a vote to say that this is what it's going to be. So, you know, I'm super interested in this project. I think it can do great. And again, if you're a patron of mine, you did see the buy alerts on this. <laughs> again, if you don't want to miss it, become a patron. Seven tiers, take your pick. Uh, it's sitting under a penny, zero, zero, three. What's the market cap? You can't see it here. I think the market cap is tiny as well. I'm going to grab it up on PooCoin real quick just so we can see. The market cap for Drive right now is, whoa, five million market cap. It's mega tiny, guys. <clears throat> Why am I hyped? Because if this does a 100x on my money, the market cap will go to a, what, 500 million? 521 million. Not billion, 521 million. It's more likely to hit that than it is to hit a billion. And that's 100 times your money back at the time of, because you can't just say 100 times your money back. I got to put the, I got to put the 100 times, you know what I mean? I got to put that. So, you know, it could be a good buy still right now. Maybe a long-term hold. I don't know. It's not investment advice. I just wanted to show you five coins that you can grab under a penny. Guys, if you liked this, please drop that like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. Are you in any of these coins? If you want to buy them, look, Drive. You can buy Drive Pancake Swap. Just real quick, look, Tailcoin. You can buy Tailcoin. Is that right? Yeah, Tailcoin on KuCoin. Ooh, these coins. You can buy it on KuCoin. I used Quick Swap on the, po on the Polygon chain. Nice and simple, straight on my ledger. Uh, let's have a quick look. Dent, you can buy Dent on Binance. Just go on to Binance and buy Dent if you want to buy Dent. Gate.io, you know, hit BTC. You can buy it everywhere, actually. Uh, Gamers, you can buy it on PancakeSwap. Do they have, have any other exchanges? No. So go on PancakeSwap and buy it there. Super, super simple. And Binamon. You can buy Binamon on PancakeSwap. If you don't know how to use it, you know, quickly check out. Oh, you can get it on uh, Gate.io as well. So they've got some good listings over here. Look, I'm seeing Hotbit. I'm seeing uh, L Bank. You know, cool. At a Mexi Global, cool. You know, you're branching out, buying them on. Guys, I'm going to leave it here. Uh, thank you for watching. Let me go up. Uh, 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 uh. Here we go. Got to see the crypto gain sign. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Cheers.